Good morning guys, it's 7 a.m. I've already been awake for a good hour, hour and a half. Um, but I just had a shower. Um, and now I'm gonna check everything for last minute things I need to pack on my bag. Um, I'm still gonna leave for the bus. Um, I'm gonna take the bus and it's nearly hospital time. So this is the view we have this morning. It's about to be, it's around half past seven in the morning. And go to my little crutches with me for after surgery. Um, so yeah. Oh my God, I'm seriously not ready for this. I seriously feel like not blowing today because my stomach is Oh my god, for a second I thought I just lost my bus, but it's another completely different bus. Oh my god. I want to have a heart attack today. Oh my god, it's freezing too. So, yeah, just going to bus station. Uh, for some random reason, my knee today doesn't hurt. I think my body is like, hey, we're concentrating everything on your anxiety and you being really nervous and being hungry instead of your knee so thank you body for that really appreciate that Hey guys, um, so yeah, excuse my face, my hair and everything, I've just, I've already been out of surgery, it's been like two hours or so, um, I've got my little thing right there, and they actually put me under the epidural, so yeah, I mean I didn't realize about that because I was like, they gave me like something to relax. So I was KO by the time that, yeah, yeah. Um, it's a really nice room. I got a room for myself. That's a good thing of being transferred from a public hospital to your prior one. I'm really, really, really waiting for some lunch because it's been more than 15 hours since I've eaten every, anything and I'm actually blogging because my mom just left the room to have something to eat or something so yeah oh my god really cannot wait I actually live in this afternoon I think they told me I was leaving this afternoon so hopefully I can get to go home Hi guys so as you can see i'm already at home um last time i talked to you i just uh looked at my phone it was around i think it's gonna be nine here yeah it's gonna be nine so it's around seven hours ago um funny thing is i just realized i was completely drugged in that video it's so funny because i don't remember actually recording that um, I did that before my nap, I think, and I don't remember anything before my nap. I sent a friend a video. I don't remember what I said. I was like, I I saw it on a snap. I was like, hey, what did I say? But it was it was good. Um, so I got to walk a little bit. Then I've got this little box um, with um, the injections I had to take as a medicine in the next 10, 12 days which i'm not really happy about i don't want any injections i had to put them on my stomach and i asked my mom to put them because i'm not like i had to put them every single day and then i had to do some um exercise i think it's like going with my hand 
lying down, I have to be like putting my leg up and down, up and down. Yeah, so I got home around, it was like seven or something. Help us, yeah, like help us seven or eight. And I had some dinner, well, I had something to eat. Yeah, and now I'm watching some soccer. I'm watching Croatia against Spain, UEFA, National League. So yeah, I'm actually really happy. I've already put my eyes on there and then um, I, I actually have a headache, but I'll probably just take some painkillers right before I go to sleep. But anyways, um, probably I will do a vlog like tomorrow uh, talking about um, talking about how my night was. Hopefully it's easy, it's good, it's pain well, it's it's painless. Um, so yeah, guys, I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Hey guys, uh, good morning. It's next day. Just woke up not long ago, so that's why my face is like looks like tired um and actually quite so learn um but let's report on my knee um it's actually amazing didn't i took a painkiller even though it wasn't it wasn't hurting too bad i mean i would say like 2 out of 10 for someone that has a really low pain tolerance that's like that's super low I, I really, really, I, I just said so good. I mean, I obviously woke up uh, a lot of times um, because I'm the kind of person that likes, I like sleeping in certain positions and with my knee like this, I cannot sleep like that. So I would just woke up because I would feel uncomfortable of my position. So I had to like move really slowly and try to put the position in a position or I wouldn't be forcing my knee to be either too bended or too straight. Especially if it was too bended um, or too bent, it's like, I think the stitches were like um, um, pressure in or something, so yeah. So anyways, um, thank you for coming in this journey with me. I know I didn't block too much in the hospital and everything, but my mind was there. Um, half the time was there i was completely drugged um so i don't know <laughs> anyways once again thank you and i really hope you enjoyed this video i'll talk to you in the next one bye